Hey guys, this is Matt Kids on the One. Today, I'm going to be teaching you about an application located on your computer called Console. You may or may not know what Console is, but basically what it does is it shows you the logs of your computer. Now my friend thinks that if you clear your console, it might speed up your computer a little bit, and I'm going to be explaining to you why. So first of all, if you, um, in the Finder menu, just click on the Finder window or whatever, then go up to go, go to folder, then type slash applications slash utilities. Okay, I will have that path in the description of this video. Now you want to locate an application called console. Now you open this up. So here's our console. And right here, if I say show log list, Here's our console messages. You can, um, since I'm not root, I can't select move to trash. But with a bunch of log files, I can just move them to the trash. Like this one, I can just move to trash. And it will save a bit of space on your computer. And, um, so, if you move them to the trash. Um, also, console will have logs from every program. Like here's some screen flow logs. Some screen flow right here. Um, there's finder errors. Okay, login logs a bunch of stuff. Sudo logs a bunch of stuff. Like it says, I tried to sudo from my Mac into the one user and I'm not in the sudoers. Even says what console I was I was on and uh, what I what what the command was. Um, right here you can see. So that's that. There are a bunch of errors in here. Also, system.log is a non-admin. You don't have permission to read system's log file. Um, also, if you want to have the permissions to read this, you can just quit console, go into terminal, and you have to execute a, a sudo command or just login as root however you want. I'm just going to type login and type my username as root and my password. Okay, so now I'm logged in as root, and all you have to do now is type cd slash application slash utilities slash console dot app slash contents slash mac os, and you type um, dot slash console. Sorry. That'll open up console as root. If I say show log list, I do have permissions to read the system log and I can move it to the trash to save a little space on my disk. The reason that it'll speed up your computer a little bit is if the logs get too big and um, your computer keeps on um, trying to save, add stuff to that file, they have to rewrite the whole entire file in order to just get another line on the file. And that the, the bigger the log file gets, the slower it gets writing, and eventually if it's pretty big, or it just physically cannot write to the log because your hard drive's totally used up. It just won't work. Which is why um, occasionally you should just move your log to the trash or get rid of a few lines of it or something like that. I like to do that every once in a while. I'm not going to move it to trash right now. Here's here's logs from my um, library from root, etc. Um, and you can just delete logs, whatever. So this is console. It's actually a great way if time machine craps out on you, it'll put a nice little error number right in here, and you'll be able to find the error number online and uh, figure out why exactly time machine's not backing up. That has happened to me a few times, and all those times I've um, gone into console since, checked the um, error number, and etc. Um, if you haven't already, watch our terminal lessons. Because if you don't understand this very well, you should watch our terminal lessons. Also, if you are an administrator, you will be able to read the system log. Um, um, so console is all about logging stuff. It's it's um, It may or may not make your computer a little faster clearing your logs. But most of the time it really won't. But um, it's a great tool and um, I suggest it to anyone who wants to easily be able to read all the logs that really matter on your computer. So um, that's how to use console.app on your Mac. 
So uh, please subscribe to Mac is in one. And goodbye.